David returns to the cabin and realizes that Florence has escaped. So he immediately goes out after her. This is a perfect opportunity to save her life. But Lucas has no intention of doing so. It turns out that Lucas wrote the threatening letter. At that party, he found out that the useless Tom is an invisible rich kid. So he became jealous and planned to blackmail Tom. He didn't expect that a letter would kill Tom. At this moment, Mary also breaks free from the tape and pushes him hard. Lucas accidentally crashes into the nail rake and receives his lunch directly. On the other hand, Florence has already arrived at the manor. She wants to go in to find a phone to call the police. But in that end, she found Tom with a ventilator. Yes, he is not dead. It turns out that Tom was saved by his brother when he was in the middle of committing suicide. But he was also paralyzed due to the lack of oxygen in his brain for too long. Only his eyes and one finger can move. When Tom learns what happened to Florence, he doesn't want his brother to do that. So he signals with his eyes for him to call the police. But before he can get to the phone, his brother David is already at his doorstep. He dodges Florence's attack with a flash and finishes him off right in front of his brother. He dodges Florence's attack and kills him right in front of his brother. He then takes his brother back to the cabin in the woods. Mary picked up the gun on the ground and shot David in the shoulder, then threw acid on David's face. The prettier the woman, the more dangerous she is. After successfully tying David to the pole, she let her boyfriend Ben go out first. He then played truth or dare with David and Tom. At this point, the truth is finally revealed. Mary took out her cell phone and played a video. Or the day of the graduation party, Ben drunk directly unconscious. So Mary wanted to play with Tom, in front of Ben for indescribable, and even photographed. But in the middle of the Ben woke up, half drunk and half awake, Ben mistakenly thought that it was Tom peeping in the room. A few months later, Mary's father's company went out of business, so she used these videos to blackmail Tom, who was rich, and the person his brother feared most was actually his older brother, who was weak and didn't want to bring shame to the family, so he chose to commit suicide the day before his brother's return. Mary put a grenade in Tom's hand and turned around to leave the cabin, and the younger brother looked at his older brother in tears.